to have still tried to reinvent the chainsaw chain. They sent us this sample to see what we think. And I've got the matching companion to it, so should we go make some magic? Bolt, where are my Firstly, I'd like to say that this video is not paid for by Still. Still are not paying us to do it, but they have supplied the new hexa chain and file for us to have a go with. First one, we are going to do a speed test. We're gonna do three cuts up and down on this nice little bit of birch. Then we're gonna swap it over for the hexa chain and do exactly the same again. So you'll all be interested to know we are using an MS400 chainsaw today and we've got two brand new chains. As James mentioned, we've got the hexa chain, which we're gonna do in the second cut and we've got the normal 3.8 chain that still supply the RS fitted at the moment and they're both fitted on with the 18 inch guide bars. The hexa chain is meant to give around 10% better cutting performance. Should we go for it? Let's do some cutting mate. Let's do some cutting. Let's go. Over to you. Cool. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> There she is. And same again with the hexa cut chain. Three, two, one, go! So I'm going to have some fun and cut some logs. And while he's having fun, I'm going to talk through the specs. Let's do it. So while James has some fun cutting wood, I'm going to talk to you about the 3.8 Hexa chain from Still. Now this model of chain is fitted to all the pro saws currently in the range, from the 400 up to the 661. As I said, this is a 3.8 chain running a 1.6 mil gauge. And what it's really designed for is to make easy filing and also give you that extra performance, up to around 10% extra cutting performance. The new innovative chainsaw chain from Still is a good choice for forestry workers professionals working in agricultural sector as it makes it possible to fell and prune trees even more quickly with your steel chainsaw. The system enables occasional users also to achieve a virtually ideal sharpening angle when sharpening. This ensures that a steel 3 rapid hexa chain will enjoy a significantly longer service life. Offering high quality cutting thanks to its full chisel tooth, rapid hexa saw chain ensures that you always cut cleanly and precisely with your chainsaw. One thing to bear in mind is only the hexa file can be used to sharpen the hexa saw chain. What a beast that is, guys. Right, let's show you how this is different and the sharpening methods are different to that of a conventional chain. Josh is going to use one of his favourite tools, the bar vise, in this nice bit of birch to be able to fix the saw in place. He knows what he's doing. I've never used one of these in my life, so I'm going to follow his lead on this and then we're going to see what it's all about. Probably worth noting, this is now a thing of the past with the hexafile chain, so we'll chuck that away, we don't need that one. Yeet that over there. One of those for you, that's and, a hexafile. And that is a hexafile, so the hex file is, well, obviously hexagon, six sides on a file. I'm sure Will's put a lovely picture up here of uh, what that looks like. But it's got a flat on two of the sides, on the other four sides it's got the filing bit. So you've actually got somewhere to work it. Main difference is being is it's a 25 degree angle on the chain rather than the 30, which is most common on other chains. Also, instead of you having to like drop your hand or anything by five degrees, it's actually you're filing it straight. So it's 90 degrees to the bar. So that's the one big difference. Hey, handle it over to Josh. We'll come a little bit closer and we'll show you what it's all about. Right, so first things first, as you can see, this is a hexagon file. So you've got a flat surface. The flat surface is to be run at the bottom of the tooth and you've got a ridge surface which will be facing you upright. Then you've got two sets of filing angles which will do your left and your right cutters. So this is the first time we've actually used it. We, you know, this is the only chain, hexa chain we've seen and the only file. So we're new to this and you can see how easy Josh is finding that because the whole idea of this chain is that people can file a chain much easier than before. With obviously a round file, there's so many different things that can go wrong. At the end of the day, if you follow the lines and directional lines that you've got on the chain and you follow the hex point in to the point of the chain, you can't really go wrong. And as you can see Josh there, he's making light work of this. I've seen this filing normally and this is much better. 
<laughs> I'm worrying about office filing. So it's come to the point in our video where we give away a prize to one of our lucky subscribers. But today is a little bit different because if you are an exclusive member to our YouTube channel, we will be giving away even better prizes. So this video contains an exclusive prize. So what have we got today, James? This one here is a, ooh, still Timber Sports guide bar. Now you can't buy these ones, so that is a really nice gift. Still baseball cap. And two key rings. But this is going to a member of our channel. Yes, it's 99 pence a month. And at the moment, we've only got four members. So there's a massive high chance of being able to win it. I don't know, what's the quick maths on that, Josh? 33.3% uh, <laughs> recurring. No, it's 25, isn't it? It's 25. You've got 25% chance of winning. So congratulations to AJP Garden Machines. You are our lucky subscriber, our member giveaway of this prize. Don't worry, we are still going to be doing our subscriber giveaways as well in other videos, but we are going to be gradually ramping this up so that our members are getting better prizes and our subscribers still get some treats as well. Right, so Josh, what was your thoughts on the Hexa chain? Ooh, you could see it was definitely more aggressive. It's definitely a faster chain. It did plough through that birch that James was cutting. What about did yourself, it? James? What, what I... did you learn? <laughs> learned it. Don't really learn much, really, no. me, you. I would say yeah, it was going to be definitely easier for sharpening. And I think that's the whole point of this. <clears throat> yeah. Because so many people do struggle with sharpening um, or don't have the right tools for it, where this is much, much easier, much simpler. And I think still done a good job on designing something that does actually work rather than just a fad. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I think it's very, very cool. Yeah, really it's good. good. Yeah. It's good. If you like our still videos, then we have got more. We've done, what other videos have we done, James? Well, your oh, yeah. accessory video. Yeah, we did. Oh, Josh yeah. done got a that top, one in my pocket. top five accessories the other day. Yeah. So that's definitely worth clicking down here and watching that one. Yeah. So have fun watching that. We're going to go do some more logging. Have fun. We'll see you in the next one.